Wow, welcome to this video. Playing with one minute less. I had pressed the five minute button and then my doorbell rang. <laughs> okay, at least it is a close position and not some wild tactical melee. Melee, melee, you know, hand to hand combat. <laughs> Malay, don't know. Okay, so let's see. It didn't help all this. Uh, I don't like so, so much this G4. Okay, let's see. Can I go F4? Mm, yeah, he might put the knight on E5, but okay, let's. I need to need to be a bit bit quicker than usual. I mean, <laughs> quicker than usual is a funny expression, uh, as I'm not really quick usually. But um, you know, trying to catch up a bit. Okay. Well, his dream scenario is knight d7, bishop f6, and something on e5. But uh, not that's not so. It's so easy to accomplish. Knight d7, yeah, there's maybe even knight b5, just attacking. If I go knight b5 and intend to take, if he goes queen b6, there's even queen b3, still. I'm doing this, come on, intending to take. I don't see how he protects it. Ah, this way is the idea, but. If I go queen a4 now, and isn't this good? Bishop. I don't see a defense against this really. Just threaten to take now. Very direct stuff, but knight g6, I'm taking d6. He can maybe make a sacrifice out of it. Yeah, the, the question is, is, should I can also take the rook here? If I play this, he probably will, he probably will just castle. Knight d6 is not really working. King king here and no move. Okay, he will castle, I guess. And now the question is if I should take. I probably shouldn't. Maybe just retreat. So that I have knight c7 available. If he goes bishop d7, I play the queen away. It's um, yeah, yeah. This is better than than taking on e7 and giving away the dark squares completely. <sighs> need to need to retreat. And now at least um, he cannot easily play bishop d6. Maybe he should even take b5 and play bishop d6. Get rid of this bishop. Yeah, all this one also not not without its points. Intending bishop e5. Mm -hmm. Okay. Want to catch up here. Okay. Let's see. I'm taking. Ah, oh, come on. Take and go here. to go to f5. If he takes g4, I take b7, attacking the queen. And now I was thinking, thinking knight f5. Maybe first this one, attacking the, attacking the knight. And now here, yeah, this looks okay. I think I'm, I have sufficient control here. It 
it's um, still this problem with the, the excellent knight here, of course. But uh, at least my my king is not a problem, which can easily happen, of course. Um, Yeah, it's not that's not at all easy to play. Maybe yeah, I should have gone to F4. This is not easy at all, but. As mentioned, it, it, it is a sufficient sufficient control. Playing against b5, and uh, next I need to. Should I go? I think I should. He cannot easily attack the pawn, and it's helpful. Rook over to f4, maybe. So rook f6. I guess I, sh I should transfer it here. Controlling h5. Yeah, that's okay. That's really okay. To have a rook here. Okay. Keeping the B farm and intending King F four. Check. Um, this one probably. Intending rook b7, just trying to take it. Yeah, this is good. Check. Black resigns. Hmm. Yeah, complicated. Yeah, he he was obviously pre-moving here, but okay, this is a better move anyway, I think. Ooh, yeah, this was tough, especially considering I had one minute less. But um, I, I, I got this pawn, and after that, it, it was it was very tricky for Black. Around here, if we concentrate on this in this spot. Ah, interesting. The computer just wants to play this. I thought that I could take here, but he's got a six. Hmm, interesting. Yeah, of course he's got a six. I can take here, and now king takes. This is of course Check. winning, but he can take with the king, which is really a bit crazy. Crazy, but um, this piece. Yeah, I can play something like that with completely unclear consequences. Yeah, I didn't see any of that, of course. <laughs> and, uh, it's it's not not clear what happens. I can push this, for example. Yeah, this is this is probably good. Yeah. Here he here played bishop f6. I thought here this was interesting. It leads to it leads to a comparable position to the game, but. Um, 
like this. Yeah, here I have I have control. I think I could here here maybe the pawn. Yeah, this was also good. This was was good. Yeah, and then rook e1. Mm, okay, I was maybe a bit too focused on catching up on the clock. Yeah, I guess here he has he has chances to blockade, but it's um, around here. It's I think it's tricky. Maybe B4 was a bit too bit too quick, but this is just just good. I think he cannot keep the blockade as as a combination of King F4 and a later Rook B6 or Rook A6 will probably win. Cannot he cannot keep the knight there, and this means. White should should really win if I can get this knight away from e5 and play e4 e5. Black should should really lose. Okay, thanks for watching.